What's up, y'all? Uh, been thinking about this for a while, and I really wanted to do a uh, an awareness video. Right now, it's the middle of summer, and you know, unfortunately, when it comes to a vehicle, you know, people forget about their kids inside their car or truck, and also their pets. You know, the windows are up, and you know, they just have to run into a store real fast, and they just they forget. And they don't realize how fast the temperature can rise inside a closed up vehicle in the direct sun. So right now, I've been parked for just a couple minutes right now. Uh, it's about 90 degrees outside, but the feel like temperature is 100 degrees outside. And right now, I've got a thermostat. So, if you guys can see that. So it's about 100 degrees inside you know, my truck right now in the cab. And um, it's about 325. So what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna be videotaping about every, I don't know, five minutes or so and see kind of what happens with this, you know, temperature gauge and see how fast it goes up and uh, see how much I can take. All right, so right now I'm about five minutes in. It is 3.30. Uh, you could start to see the sweat on my neck. Uh, the sweat on my arm. I'm, I'm literally, my arms are beating up in sweat right now. And in just five minutes, the temperature has come up five degrees. So from 100 to 105 in five minutes. Um, and I'll show you guys, windows are completely closed, side windows, and over here, these windows are closed, the back window, you know, is closed up here in the center, so, and I definitely got the sweat on the face, so it's, uh, it's getting up there, man, it's, it's, like, it's like an oven, it's exactly like an oven, I mean, you could definitely see it, and that's just five minutes. So, you know, again, five minutes, I'll do it again. All right, right now it is uh, 3.35. And now you're actually starting to see the sweat come through my shirt. It's obviously beating up on my nose. I mean, my arms. Here, I'll go to this one. I don't know if you can see that. I mean, it's just... I mean, it's just dripping. So, temperature right now in here is just shy of about 110 degrees. So in about 15 minutes, it's gone up 10 degrees in here. Uh, it's, it's warm, you know what I mean? I mean, I can only imagine if I was like a kid a pet, you know, just amazes me. They rely on us, that's the bottom line, you know, but I'll get back to you in a little bit. All right, 3.40, five minutes later. It's, it's hot, I'm not gonna lie here. Right now it's about, so it's 110 in the cab. And this thermometer right here is completely out of the direct sunlight. So, I mean, you look at the dashboard. That's where the sun is right here. And I'm literally sitting in the shade. And guys, I'm drenched. You know, this is not a spritzer bottle. And I'm not drinking anything while I'm in here. I'm literally sitting in my cab of my truck. And, uh, I mean, again, windows closed. So in between the five minutes of me shooting, um, it's not like I'm opening up the windows. It's not like I'm going outside. I'm not drinking water. You know, this is just straight 
you know, beating of the sun. Let me turn this around like this. And you can just see the, the sun direct coming in here on the windshield. So, it's just hot. It's just hot. I mean, I couldn't even imagine that only after, what, 5, 10, 15, 20, 20 minutes. And you could see that progression every five minutes. Um, I can only imagine what a, uh, you know, what a baby, a child, or a pet goes through, you know, in this situation. You guys got to be aware. You guys got to know they, they rely on us. And I'm definitely at this particular point starting to get like shortness of breath. You know, and I think you could tell too, but I'll catch you guys back in five minutes. Three forty five right now. Again, the temperature right now is about still 110 degrees. It's gone up just a little bit, like maybe 111. I mean look at this shirt. Guys, this is all sweat. And right now my phone is actually um, getting that warning sign of overheating, which it is. So the phone's overheating, it's so damn hot in here. Um, it, the air is so stagnant in here right now, being that it's so hot. It's not like being outside in this temperature where the, the it's moving. Uh, it's fucking hard to breathe. You know, almost feels like you're in a, a sauna or something like that, but I don't know how much longer I can do this. I mean, I can physically keep going, but I don't know. My phone's just at the point where it's just overheating, I guess. I'm going to try to do the best I can to keep moving, so, you know. Again, 3.45, five minutes later. 3.50. Temperature has gone up to uh, about 112, 113. So it's rising up here. I mean, again, look at my shirt. Now it's coming down the center. You know, the sweat on my arms, face. And obviously you can see it. It's getting hot. It's like an oven. I'll try to keep you posted. My phone's just getting overheated. I got that little thing on the corner of the camera, a little hazard sign. Again, awareness, man. You got kids, you got pets. I don't give a, I don't give a shit. If you gotta run to the store for 30 seconds or a minute or whatever. Your kids, your pets, they rely on you. You gotta be aware, you know. Even if those windows are cracked a little bit, It's rough. It's rough. I'll get back to you. 350. You know, I just noticed something. My hands are getting all wrinkly from the sweat. You know, my palms and everything like that. Right now it's, it's about 113. Again, this is in the shade, not on the dashboard. I'm just, just more drenched, more soaked. And I'm looking at the flag out there. Flag's actually waving in the breeze. So there's a slight breeze outside, but not in here. It's just stagnant. It's stale. Windows are closed. You know, there ain't no air on. Everything is turned off. I'm just in a hot box. This is no joke. The sauna, you know, and I kind of I knew I was doing this. So up here, I'm prepared. But as a kid, as a child, or a pet, you're way past the point of heavily breathing, the crying, not knowing what's going on, the panicking. You know, a kid in a child seat too. You're wrapped up like a cocoon around fabric and clothes. And me, I'm wearing, I'm wearing a t-shirt, you know, I got shorts on, but 
Man, the sweat is freaking nuts. I actually just want to fall asleep. You know, so we get so hot. I'll see you guys at the top of the hour. All right, top of the hour, four o'clock. I've been in my truck for now 40 minutes. In the heat. I mean, this shirt is just absolutely drenched. You can't see the bottom because I guess the way the sun is hitting. But I'm soaked right now. It's about 115 degrees, you know, in the cab, just stale. And I just thought about something. The longer I'm in here, the more I'm using oxygen, and the more you almost start to get delusional, lightheaded, you know. Um, almost got to pause just to kind of think, regroup. It's fucking hot. It's hot. My hat is just soaked right now. By this point, I'm almost thinking a kid, child, pet. I don't know. Be aware. I don't know how much more my phone can actually take of the heat. I'm starting to get like heat warnings on my on my camera. Guys gotta think. I hope this brings awareness to you with kids and pet animals. I can feel it. My heart's actually starting to race right now. I'll see you in a little bit. All right, it's 405. The temperature came up to now 115. You know, the sweat is actually burning my eyes right now. And I'm soaked. I mean, you look at my palm. It's all wrinkled up. I cannot. I'm going to try to do this for another 15 minutes. So a total of one hour. But I'm telling you, it is getting hard. It is getting hard. I can feel the burning. Yeah, look at my shirt. You can't see the bottom all the way. Hopefully I'll do it later because of that line of where the sun is and the shade. But it's my whole abs, they're just soaked. Even my shorts and everything. Get back to you in a little bit. So right now it's 410. Thermometer, 115. I just thought of something. Yeah, and this thing is in the shade. 115 degrees, that's not the feel like temperature. It's gotta be hotter than that. I'm soaked. Sweat's beating off my arms. I can literally just feel the heat coming off my skin and just baking. Air is heavy. You hear my breathing. And I'm not bullshitting around. Sweat's stinging my eyes. And my heart is actually starting to race. It's been racing for a while now. I'm going to try to stick this out for another 10 minutes so it's a full hour. But I'm feeling it fucking, I'm feeling it heavy. Starting to get a headache too. Right now it's 4.15. So some of the things I'm experiencing right now, obviously, I mean, the light gray in my shirt is almost completely gone. A couple patches, but it is just absolutely drenched right now. Sitting at about 116 degrees on the thermometer. I don't know what the feel like temperature is. My heart is racing. I'm literally holding on. I'm just like, every minute feels like 10 minutes. Palm of my hand. You know, again, now my fingertips are starting to. Oh, shit. Can't even get a breath out. It's hard to take a deep breath. I'm taking like these micro breaths. Struggling for the next five minutes. I'm not even joking. That's gonna be. Next five minutes are gonna be like, it's gonna be a lot. It's gonna be a lot. All right, guys, one hour. I'm not gonna do any more, there's no point. There's no point. You get the idea. 
my sh my shirt was a like right now. It's just it's I am just dripping in sweat. Thermometer about 116. Stagnant air. Heart is racing really really fast. I'm trying to keep up. My body's in kind of survival mode right now. That's for damn sure. I haven't had water. Windows are closed. You know, side windows. The car's not running. You know, keys are out. All right. Shit wasn't running for the full thing. The air is off. If you have kids, pets, and you bring them in your car, you gotta remember, you, I don't care what you come up with. You gotta remember you got them in the car. Because I guarantee, at this particular point, they won't be able to last an hour, 15, 20 minutes. Brain, you start, they start to get, you know, brain damage. I hope this video helped at least one of y'all. And do me a favor, share this with anybody who has pets. Kids, I gotta get out of this car. I gotta get out of this car. Oh, I'm weak. Oh my God, it's so cool out here right now. Be aware. That's not easy. That was not easy. One hour into my truck in the direct sunlight. Awareness. I gotta go sit on the curb. I'm actually stumbling right now. Well, I'm actually, hold on, I'll, let me flip the camera around here if I can. It's not even allowing me. My phone is so overheated. Well, I'm trying to walk this line in a parking lot and I'm literally stumbling. This is rough. Don't, do not have the regret of by accident. Do not have the regret by accident leaving your child or somebody else's child or a pet in your vehicle. I'm in the shade right now. Look down. This is dry. This is absolutely saturated. <clears throat> I have to do another video just to let you know that I, where my truck sits because I can't do a reverse on my camera. My truck is right there in the absolute beating sun. Nothing I can do, nothing else I could do to bring y'all awareness. But the temperature right now, where I'm at, whew. Man, I am lightheaded and I wish y'all could see how my heart is racing. I don't ever want to do that again. You know, about 10 minutes ago, I saw a cop come around and went, turned the corner and started going away from me. Ow. I was thinking to myself, I was, I was in really, really, really in trouble. Man, I just wish that he kind of knew. Do a U-turn, something. This ain't no joke. Thank you guys for following the whole thing every five minutes as I did this. Just, have, just be aware. Just be aware. I haven't had a drink in, what time is it right now? Right now it's 4.25. 425 it's been easily over an hour since I've had something to drink I wish I was in like an air-conditioned room or a fan on me or something
Thank you guys for following along. Hope I brought awareness to you. It's July 21st. July 21st and it's summertime. And there's other places that are a hell of a lot harder, hotter than this. Thank you.